Okay, so installing the two-piece rear main seal in the FE engine. So we got all our bearings in and already plastic gauged. And um, there's some certain procedures here to putting this in, if we can focus our camera. So you see how there's a cutaway in the lip right there where it'll compress together? That faces the front of the engine. So um, see how it's at an angle here? That faces the back. Now the process to put these in is uh, you're first supposed to soak these in oil for a few seconds then immediately um, put them in the block. So you want to have everything all lined up. So you see we got our crank with our assembly lube all done, all our bearings got our assembly lube so we're going to be pretty quick about this and get it in and what the uh, what it calls for in all the Ford engine books is that the end be held up a little bit in this orientation so that there's a crossover actually when you put the bearing in so it's supposed to be up three-eighths of an inch so as you can see we got our caliper here set just right and it's just perfect so anyway we're gonna go ahead and put our um, drop our crank in put our main caps on and get it torqued down right quick but you definitely want to be quick about it because these seals are designed to expand in oil so we'll go ahead and do that All right, we got our crank in, and here goes our main cap. Going down and in. Notice the offset that we mentioned before. So, seem to go down pretty good. Now we'll get it torqued down to our uh, first torque spec, 70 foot-pounds. Okay, so we actually made a mistake when we were putting ours in, and you want to slide these side seals in here first, so before you run this down in, and they're kind of tricky as they're pretty tight, so what we found to do is to uh, overhang them a little bit past the main cap, you know, so they're sitting a little bit down, and then we get those curled in on either side and started and then it's pretty easy to get your main cap down so as you can see here we're just working it on down now pretty nice and easy so now that we're putting in our pins for our side seals here um, when you start them you want to come in um, if you got to go at an angle at all you want to try and angle them towards the metal because if you angle them the opposite direction you might drive them into your seal and ruin it so, and you wouldn't really know until you started leaking oil when you lit it off, so it's a good method to avoid that. So, it takes a few sharp blows, but they should go down flush. There it is. So, I'm um, going to repeat that for the second one.